What's going on by the police here? Maya, she's uh, been arrested. What for? Why did you ask Liv? She might be able to fill you in about a little blackmailing scheme. All right, David, leave it. Come on. I think I'll pass. I'm not sure that carbon's one of the main food groups. You're in a good mood. Yeah, well, the exam went all right, didn't it? You can at least try and look pleased for me. Maybe I would be if I hadn't seen David before. David? What's he got to do with it? Well, I was hoping that you might be able to tell me. I don't know what you're talking about. So you don't know anything about me being arrested? Well, why would I? Well, maybe because the police were at the shop and David's telling me to ask you about blackmail. Is, he, is that what he said to the police? I don't know how do I live, but he didn't look happy. And as there obviously is something going on, you might want to tell me before they come knocking on our door. What's going on? <laughs> Liv, come here. Come here. Come here. Look, it's fine, all right? Whatever it is, we'll sort it, but you need to tell me what's happened. And given a voice recording. It gives intimate details about Jacob's alleged relationship with you in his own words. How can you explain this? I never heard that recording. But you did know it existed. Let's just say I was threatened with it. Threatened by who exactly? When Jacob dumped his little girlfriend Liv, she accused him of seeing someone behind her back. And she thought that it was you. I don't know why. She's a teenage girl. Hormones running all over the place. And the recording? When she confronted Jacob with it, maybe he just played out his fantasy. You mentioned you were threatened with the recording. That's right. The last thing I want to do is get Liv into trouble. Liv Flaherty, that is. She's been having a difficult time recently. She's been in a young offenders. Just tell us what you know. She told me that she had a recording of Jacob admitting the truth about us. I told her that was rubbish. I'd never had an inappropriate relationship with a student. She threatened to ruin my career if I didn't give her £10,000. And did you get the money for her? No, of course I didn't. Even if I had that sort of money. I just thought, why has he done that to me? He was supposed to be my boyfriend. Look, I get that you're angry with him. But that's still no reason to go and blackmail him and Mayor, is it? The first thing I wanted to do was tell David. I, I wanted to watch him squirm when it all came out. And I started getting second thoughts and I was I was going to back out, but May, May was so horrible to me. She was. I just... I wanted to use the money to, to help you and Rob with the surrogate. Yeah, but Liv... Me and Robert can sort our own problems out. You didn't need to go and break the law for us. I know. I'm sorry. I'm... Everything was just really messed up and I just wasn't thinking straight. Oh, I just wish you would have talked to me. You really think I don't? No, if, if the police have arrested me, it's only so long before they're going to want to speak to me. I know. That's why we need to get your story straight. You didn't keep any of that money, did you? No. What was I thinking? It's fine. We'll think of something. No. No, I I've got to tell the police the truth. I owe this to Jacob. Will you come with me? You know I will. <laughs>